This parent, who wishes to remain anonymous, is one of several that received an email provided to Fox 7 saying that their children's school, the St. Elizabeth Early Childhood Development Center in Pflugerville, would be closing suddenly. All of the parents received an email on Friday afternoon, just this past Friday, from the director of the preschool just saying that the preschool was going to be closing after the end of the school year, which is... The email says that the last day of school will be May 19th. Any registration and supply fees that were already paid for the following school year would be refunded. This parent says the timing did create a bit of a hiccup in her plans for the fall. The majority of the private Catholic preschool programs, they typically, in my experience, will open up their enrollment in typically February and March. And a lot of the programs, they are smaller, and so they fill up very quickly. Some of the parents, they wouldn't be able to enroll their children. The school is operated alongside the St. Elizabeth of Hungary Church for 25 years, and the decision was made to, quote, make space in the building for other purposes. Some parents even started a petition to save the school. Found out is that was not absolutely not their intent, and it was actually just kind of a, a accidental fallout of it that they hadn't fully considered. As a church member, this was surprising to me. Rudy Mateer has been attending the church for more than a decade. All the kids who are involved in that program have a good, solid education and background. We know it's it, we know it's hard enough to find a Catholic program, e, you know, faith even faith-based programs that are good quality child care programs. He hopes the church can ultimately decide to reopen the school possibly in the future. Hopefully, after you bringing attention to this, there can be a further conversation about what can or cannot be done regarding that program. As for parents, they're left to decide on where their kids will go in the fall. This mother says she will likely put her child back in a previous school she was in. We're possibly looking at the possibility of, you know, going back to that program, you know, and I'm looking at assisting some other parents. Fox 7 reached out to St. Elizabeth and they told us they would be preparing a statement to release in the next day or two. In Pflugerville, Bridget Spencer, Fox 7 Austin News.